Yo, what's up? So I just wanted to show you guys this house that we rented here in uh, the Iona part of Fort Myers. So this is the back yard area, well back entertaining space with the pool. So we actually got this place through uh, Marriott, the homes and villas portion of uh, Marriott. We use Marriott points, but incredibly, like if we just wanted to pay for it, I think it would have been less than $150 a night, which is insane. Uh, but maybe being during this pandemic, there's not as much uh, demand. I know it is the slow season here anyhow, but here's what's cool too, this, uh, this little bar here. You can open up these windows, go right into the kitchen, which has been pretty cool. Got a grill, that was big. Cooking some chicken tonight on that. Here is the kitchen. Actually, cooking up some lunch, some leftovers. Some nice appliances here. They have uh, Viking appliances. It's actually kind of surprised to see that. Really like this place overall. The TV is phenomenal. Desk, workspace. And you have one bedroom here, guest bedroom. This is the kids' room. I guess it's an extra bedroom. And then our room's a mess. Oh, here's the uh, guest bathroom. <clears throat> Our room's a bit of a mess, but overall, very nice. Nice TV. And I really like the shower. The shower is awesome. So, that's just a little tour of our place here. But this is new to us. We don't normally rent homes. If you, if you've seen our videos, it's mostly hotels, resorts. But overall, I, and we've been here a few days now, no complaints. I think, uh, I think this may be an option for us down the road in uh, some different areas that we go. So now that it's part of Marriott as well. But all right, everyone, just wanted to show you that. And uh, if you have any questions or anything about booking through Marriott, uh, you know, put a comment down below, let me know, and uh, we can help you out. See ya, peace. We're hoping, today's the day after Memorial Day. Every class it's crowded. And we're hoping it's not as crowded. Yeah. Uh, what is expensive is getting over yeah. the bridge here. So you do have to pay $6. Yeah. Um, just to enter you know, the bridge and go over the bridge and get to the island. So yeah. just be prepared for that. <laughs> if, if you do decide to, to drive down here and visit this place. but. Yeah, it looks really cool. The weather should be okay today. It's a little cloudy right now. So yesterday, they yes. were saying, calling for 100% chance of rain all day long, and it ended up being beautiful after about 12.30, and it did not rain until 8.30 at night. So you just don't know what you're gonna get. You really don't, no. But we're glad to be here Yeah. and actually have a vacation. Yeah, because it's during the end. During the pandemic. pandemic. So, all right, well, catch you in a minute. All right, so <clears throat> there is a 
paying, you gotta pay for park here. And it looks like they take credit cards, they take cash. I got it until one o'clock, so about four and a half hours. restrooms at least. Yeah, we're carrying a bunch of stuff. <laughs> you had a feeling it would be a long walk, huh? Well, I'm sure we'll be glad we have it. Looks like we have a spot. It's not really the kind of beach I envisioned. We probably didn't need to bring half the stuff. That's just... uh, fine. Okay. It's just a little bit of a walk from the car. Like That's all. beach. We're heading to Fort Myers Beach, which is about a 15 minute drive from where we're staying. Yesterday we did the Sanibel Island, Captiva, Bowman's Beach. I thought it was okay. What'd you think, Rach? Yeah, it was good. It was, good. It's, it was different, Very chill. I thought. Yeah, it's like a park beach. Yeah, so. just a little bit of a walk from the car to actual beach, mm -hmm. um, which you guys saw in the video. But yeah, today I really don't know what to expect. Uh, Fort Myers Beach, heard some good things. Um, I don't know if it's going to be crowded or not. I would expect it to be more crowded than uh, the beach was yesterday at Bowman's, but we'll uh, see. Looks like it's going to be a great day. Otherwise,
All right, so we found a parking spot right here. Eight bucks for the day. For the day. Till 2 a.m. So a little better than yesterday. for a nice day at the beach right go this way Everybody, it's our last day of beach, beach time. So we hit up uh, Bowman's Beach already. We hit up Fort Myers Beach today. Our last day, we're hitting up Anita Springs Beach. So it's about another 20 minutes drive south past uh, Fort Myers Beach. And there's some incredible rental I mean, they are beautiful. Yeah, these properties Homes. along the beaches here, I'm not sure if they're rentals and people own them. I'm sure most uh, people own them. Yeah, they look, they look <laughs> just incredible. Uh, so I'm really excited to see this beach. We have no idea really where we're going. Hopefully it's parking. And um, yeah, later on we're going to Naples to the Turtle Club for lunch. So peace out, see you on the beach. So yeah, we got to Bonita Beach and it seems very residential so there's really there's a bunch of little parking lots and we went all the way to one because that's where we put our gps and just a warning it wasn't even 9 a.m and that one lot was already filled so all the all the other lots seem pretty small so you better get here probably before 8 30 if you want to make sure you yeah you some of the, the parking lots are numbered like one through 10 or 12 or whatever some of them have like four spots yeah so, just a warning, come to Bonita Springs or Bonita Beach. Right? Bonita Beach. I just use more residential and stuff. So <clears> there's <throat> a lot of, it's not a lot of parking available. Yep. All right.
do you think, Rach? Pretty nice. Nice beach. Yeah. Is this your favorite one so far? Yeah, it's fine. The actual water and the beach part is my favorite. I mean, each beach you went to is so different. Yeah. So, but yeah, I like it.